Hey guys, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII. When we last left off, we uh, went to Tears Point after uh, exploring a little bit around uh, uh, Esther, and got the Solomon Ring and tried to summon Doom Train, which we can't because we didn't have all the abilities yet. But I'll explain that in just a second. Then we went to Lunar Point, uh, Lunar, the Lunar Gate where uh, three of the party members were cryogenically frozen and sent out into space. And now there's this big huge thing headed toward Esther, and Zell and the rest of the party are now heading toward Esther to find out what the heck it is. So, uh, I was able to get the steel pipe after all uh, from the, uh, instead of, uh, with the Wendigos, instead of going to the Wendigos and stuff. Uh, found out thanks to my friend Steve from the Engage Gamers, you can modify Elastoid cards. You get Elastoid cards. One Elastoid card modifies into a steel pipe. I had three, and I went in here to Esther, and I'll show you the guy in just a second, and got three Elastoid cards from the card game. And if you notice now, I have the six steel pipes. So the only thing I need now is the six Remedy Pluses, and I can't get that until I get Alexander's Met Up ability. So, anyway. You go up in here, and you, I, I played the, I played it from this guy right here. This guy right here was the guy that gave me uh, uh, the Alastoid cards. So anyway, we're going to continue on with the story uh, until we, once we get Alexander's met up ability, I can get those 60 remedies into 6 remedy pluses, and I'll be able to get Doom Train right then and there. So, so anyway, we're going to continue on with the main story. We go west. And like I said, Adia is stuck with us in this party. And I decided to bring in Self because she needs to level up a little bit anyway, so. Here at West. And then we're going to head Southwest. And this should lead us right to, yep, Odin's lab. Quake. Oh, yeah, we're going to give that to Self. She's going to use some more. Are you here to see the doctor? Yes. Dr. Odin's in a good mood right now. He hasn't been this cheerful in quite a while. Fine. We're gonna go see the doctor. And we got booty, a selfie booty right there. Double, we'll give that to self. And we're supposed to take this, get on. Let's get on the couch elevator. And uh, we're gonna take us the usual spots. This should look a little familiar to you now. From Laguna's Dream. Yep, so we're oh, actually part of Laguna's Dream now. And now we go up in here. And this is where Dr. Odin should be at. So. Why is Lunatic Pandora here now? Who is moving that thing? So that was Lunatic Pandora. Galbadian, sir. They're the ones that salvaged it. We must sound the alert in the city now. It will not attack us. The city is not the target. I hope so. I hope you're right. But Tears Point. Hmm? Let's talk to... Hello. So we meet again. This is exciting. What's exciting about this? This and that with Galbadia and all? It's been a long time since I last saw Lunatic Pandora. That Lunatic... Whatever. That big thing. What the hell is that? What the hell is going on? Oh, you want to hear my story? Is that this nice? I would be happy to tell you. I've been a guest in Team Pandora since it was excavated. So we serviced it. Grrr. And investigated it. I don't care about that. What do you want? What's going to happen? What do we do? That is what I'm about to. The enemy's coming, right? And there's no time. We'll do something about it. Just tell us what to do. Make it short. Short, eh? Are you sure about that? That is too bad. Yes, this could be very bad. You want to go inside and stop it? Then look at this. He's going to tell us how to stop this lunatic Pandora, whatever the heck it is. This is a map of the Esther region. Lunatic Pandora's current location is here. Okay, so it's off the shore of Esther. Lunatic Pandora's suspected course will undoubtedly pass over the city. Zoom in map. The city has one outer skyway and two main inner skyways, all leading to the palace. 
The Lieutenant Bandor will head east from the vicinity of this lab toward a shopping mall. The time will take to cross the city is estimated to be 20 minutes. Boarding Lunatic Pandora as possible at the following three contact points. The first contact point is at the center of the city. You will arrive there five to eight minutes after enters into the city. There's equivalent to 15 minutes or 12 minutes left on your timer. The second contact point is unknown. We believe it's where the two skyways cross. So Lunatic Pandora will arrive there 10 to 15 minutes after enters the city. You know, and then the last point will be the third compact target is north of the shopping mall. We'll arrive there 17 minutes after the inner city. It's equivalent to three to two, three minutes left on your timer. End of briefing. So we have three contact points we have to enter um, Lunatic Pandora. That's just how it goes. I will give you this. Look at it with square. The problem is, all right, all right, we got to get going. I want to talk some more. Talk to him again. See, culprit is now Galbadia. What do you want? Awesome. Now you want to know. He knows that monsters come from uh, falling from the moon. Not very often that it happens. You don't know? Pandora has effect on the moon. That may be the immediate problem rather than Galbadia. Tears point lunatic Pandora together to maximize the effect. So, uh... Apparently, there's enemies falling from the moon. Alright. So now, we're going to head on down. And as soon as we leave Oling's lab, we, the 20-minute timer for P Lunatic Pandora begins. And we have to get there on the in one of the three contact points in order for us to enter Lunatic Pandora. If we fail the first one, then we go to the second one and the third one and stuff. But if we fail all three, it's not a game over. You just can't enter and you miss out on a lot, a lot of good items. So... I mean, there's nothing else we can do. Looks like it's here. Here we are. So for the uh, first contact point, we're going to enter the first contact point. Where is it? There it is. We're going to head east from here. Here's how we get to the first contact point. And it's headed for the center. Oh, I think I'm headed the wrong direction anyway. Yeah. I think from that uh, turnbuckle that uh, from Dr. Odin's lab that was east. And now from here we need to head west. So actually I was headed the wrong direction. So we need to head west here. And then north. And yes, we can get to bring in a battle, so just be ready. Which is kind of good anyway, because we need to get uh, Alexander's met up, met up level ability. That way we can get... Uh, that way we can get uh, Doom Train. So, it's not exactly a bad thing that we get Kramer to come. But you just got to be careful with the timer. As long as we're careful, we got it. So there we go. Potion and 3 AP, so we're 3 AP closer to getting it. So here we need to head north, which is this way. Then north again. You guys are fighting Galbadian soldiers. Then east. Now this is fine. More AP equals closer to getting met up ability, which is closer to getting doom tra- Oh, Xantha Zookan! Yeah, Alright! Sit back and enjoy the theatrics of Odin. I had Odin pop up a few times while I was trying to farm those marble tentacles. 
오전주 And got some slicey slice, slice and dice, and easiest AP you'll get. Level up, potion, Phoenix down, 4 AP, James Ricardo leveled up, Brothers leveled up, Leviathan leveled up, Trevor leveled up. Nice. So we're going to head east. Remember that guy that we talked to? That said, oh yeah, all kind of stuff up here. Now we talked to him again, he should give us an item, so. We got all car. This guy right here should give us an item now, so let's see what the action is. You see, scientific engineering abilities are important. Personal training is important, too. Yes, sir, I'm done, so you can have it. Combat King 004. We get the fourth Combat King. And then you had East Tier. And actually, right here is where the first contact point is. So, we just chill out around here until the until the uh, combat point, or until the uh, pit lunatic Pandora comes. So, form a little. Uh, it should be coming within the next minute anyway. So. Come on, Stealth, you steal something. One missile? Okay, better than nothing, I guess. And there we go. So, it should be here any second now, actually, so. Instead of between, you know, five to eight minutes, so. No items, 3 AP for it. Ifrit leveled up, Siren leveled up, Beyond. Oh, and Ifrit gains his last ability, so Ifrit can learn no more abilities. Oh, man. There it is. Huh. We're supposed to do what? Any checkpoint, we'll get into a battle with an elite soldier and a Galbadia soldier, so. Nothing to it. And then we'll be able to enter Lunatic Pandora pretty easily. So. Man, if Delphi can kill one of those in one hit, they're pretty pathetic. So. so, we should be able to enter Lunatic Pandora now. Adia leveled up to level 28. Three more AP. She learned a new ability and Alexander leveled up. Now was a chance. And now we are inside Lunatic Pandora and that was... It's not hard. I like the music too. There's a... Um, ooh, Meteor. Let's give that to... Uh, selfie. So from here, now we're inside Lunatic Pandora. All right, and there's some stuff we can get up in here. Now for here, okay, first things first, there's a draw point here. With Kiraga, we'll give that to self. I should've got that to self, but I will First things first, you notice there's three elevators. We're gonna enter the elevator that's marked number three. So, all right, Lunatic Pandora. We, we did catch it in time. Wow, but what in the world is food to Pandora? Ah, you recognize this area now? So now we're gonna head southeast, down the stairs. Climb down this ladder. It's a little tricky going down the ladder. Hey, get out, get your dress off of Zell, Adia. And there's another hidden draw point here. Confused. Look at that. Now. now we need to head east to a dead end. And if you look around there, you get a love, love G. Don't know what that is, but whatever. It works. 
Let's check to see what this love, love G is. But remember, that's from, uh... Raises compatibility with all, uh... GF. Remember this from, uh, one of Laguna's dreams? The Central Ruins kind of place? This is where we're at now. And we got another Galbadia soldier that's probably gonna die in one year because they suck. Ah, I stand corrected. They're actually going to do a little damage to us first. Okay. Whatever. It works. And they actually were able to take off a lot more damage. Than... Jackie! Uh, I don't know where our dog went. We need to head west, continue heading west here. And enter the right door for a power generator. Enter the center door for a silence. And we'll just go back to the right door. And then the left door. Your last chance to get a uh, Phoenix Pinion if you haven't gotten one yet. And then head west. Now, if you, if you look right there, there's Combat King 05. Now we're gonna head, now we got to head all the way back to the three elevator room. There's nothing else we can do down here right now. So all the way down to three elevator room. And uh we'll take another elevator. So Hey Xanthazookin! Woo! Sit back and enjoy the theatrics again. Xanthazookin is nice, it gives you the easiest AP to possibly get. So Odin's nice. Um, so. oh, all right, there we go. And dead soldiers. And some more levels, three potions, and three AP. Time very leveled up. Now we're getting closer and closer to getting Doom Train. Now we're going to climb back up the ladder and just like I said, uh, head back. Now get your dress off a selfie. Alright, so now we're heading all the way back to the elevator. So there we go. Then we're going to take another elevator to get out of this area now, because there's really nothing else we can really do in this area. We've gotten all the items. There's really not much. We're going to go over here and take elevator number one, the green elevator. So there we go. Now in this room, you have to kind of be, kind of look carefully. If you go on this, uh, this holy, ooh, look at that gazelle. There's a hole in the left wall. Right up in here, I think. It gives you speed J scroll. And now we're just gonna take north a couple times and we'll be out of here. So we're almost out of the Lunatic Pandora area, so that would be nice. And we get another one of these things. Whatever. It works. Snake the doodle! And I forgot these things counterattack and hurt like a mug. Yeah, but they're still not too hard. 
One more hit from Stealthy should actually take care of it. Yep, I was wrong. Never mind. Maybe a deal will take care of it. No. Zell? There we go. Zell took care of it. <laughs> Did I just see a panty shot? I'm not sure if that was or not, but I'll have to look at that. That was interesting. Looked like a panty shot from Selfie. I'll have to take a look at that. Pervert! Ah. But, uh, we're gonna end it here, guys. We'll come back. We just had a couple of screens to the north, and we'll be in a new area, which will be. But where is it? And what about Squall and all of them? You'll find out next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII. This is DKS3 the Crazy Gamer. Signing out.